Okay, so this is the daily routine. Come out to the studio, have a look around, see where I left off yesterday. Um, sometimes I have a pretty specific plan of what I'm gonna make. Sometimes I have no clue. Um, I've been making a lot of these glass dip pens lately. Having a lot of fun with those. Um, I'm actually just kind of in the middle of trying to decide what I'm going to make today and I thought I'd try to make another video. Um, I pulled a few new pieces of prep the other day that I have to work with. Um, just a second. I'll grab a piece and show you. So yeah, I've got got some new tube, new line tube to work with. Thought about making another wine glass or some of this maybe. Maybe that's what I'll do today. Um, this new solid cane to pull down. This stuff right here pulls down. Looks like this. Uh, I made a I made a pen with some of this already. This is good to go for another pen. That's probably what I'll do with that today. One of the things I'll do today. Um, yeah, I think what I'll do for this video is make another wine glass. And so I'll, the last one that I made Right here, this is a pretty cool design, I thought. <clears throat> uh, got this rainbow wigwag section here. And this is like, it's basically a three piece design. That's kind of neat. And so the foot and stem is all one piece and hollow. Um, so I was able to use the same prep uh, for this section and this foot stem section. And then this is the, this is the first kind of, I use the optic mold to shape this here. <clears throat> I'd like to do another one like this with this line prep and this shape right here, I, I'd like to have it a little bit more, you know, round. So that's kind of, you know, looking at this, like I, I love how this turned out. The only thing I want to change is kind of bring this into a more of a squat, you know, uh, like a wheel shape. It's kind of tricky to do with that optic stuff and still keep the optics, but seems like a good idea. Yeah, so that's pretty much my creative process. I'm trying to like talk out loud on camera <laughs> while I figure out what the hell I'm going to do today. Uh, yeah, so this is all kind of new for me trying to make these videos um i not super comfortable with it just yet but uh yeah i have to have to do it in order to get over all that no learning more about how to edit this stuff um so i can make it a little bit more a little bit less painful for you guys to watch. Um, so, I think I'll head over to the torch and get this going. See how it goes. Wish me luck and enjoy. I'll see you at the end of the video. Thank you.
Here we go. That all went well enough. Made it safely into the kiln. Took it out this morning. All looks pretty good to me. Kinda, like I was saying, kinda sh got a little bit sh more squat shape on this thing. Um, this tubing I pulled, it's got, you know, some stringer work on the outside, so you get a little bit different pattern on the outside than you do on the inside. It's kind of cool. There's the bottom. A little wigwag stem. It's pretty beefy. <clears throat> so, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Try to keep it up for you guys. <clears throat> Cheers.